it's your girl back again. It's your girl with the haul of the day. Hey, it's your girl back again. And yes, guys, hey, it's your girl Aurora. That girl who likes to cosplay. And if you guys do not know from the title down below or up above, wherever it is, this is a Universal Studios Wizarding World of Harry Potter haul. Yes, I've been waiting eons to do this. I'm in my Hufflepuff house robe attire. Not spawns, not gotten from Universal Studios, actually. These are Weasley oriented has the word eBay so please don't forget to thumb up this video let's try to get this video up to likes I am NOT asking for much um, I do know the new monitoring stuff for YouTube is a thousand views and then of course you can monitor let's try to get this video up to two or was it a thousand views <laughs> yeah with the grand old world of YouTube who knows sorry guys I keep on looking over here that's my stop button but yes I have one two three four five six items seven Seven items from the Wizarding World of Harry Potter. I hope you guys do like. Like I said, thumb it up. Follow me on all my social media sites. I am at Hey, It's Your Girl Aurora, Girl Likes to Cosplay over on Facebook. Same way it's typed on my YouTube vids. Also, too, come and find me at Lady underscore Frieza underscore cosplays. I just uploaded an outfit of the day up here on my channel, but also, too, it's over there as well. So let's get on into it. So for my Christmas present, my boyfriend got me an annual pass, Wizarding World of Harry Potter, because if you guys do not know, I love me some Harry Potter. Yes, indeed, you doodle. So the first thing that we got here, this is on day two of our, ooh, hello, there we go. Day two of our escapades, it's the Universal Studios filler up cup, if you will. Yeah, it's just one of those Universal Cups. You can fill it up all day now. The only bad thing is nowadays is that back when I was a kid, you could take these to Universal Studios or any other theme park and you can fill them up and whatnot. But now they have a sensor on the bottom of the can or at the bottom of the cup here that only lets you know the appropriate times of when you can fill up the drinks. And yeah, now we can't chintz out on Universal or anything. <sighs> Couldn't really do it, but yeah, I have water filled up in this one. So it's the Universal Tumblr that my boyfriend got me. All this stuff was for my boyfriend, um, except for one of my things over here from Wizarding World that was from his daughter. So I love it. Oh my gosh. Okay, let's not delay any further. Because, yeah, so of course we have the Tumblr. We had the pass, which was for Christmas. Now we actually have the items of which my boyfriend got for me and also I bought too. Now I bought him a Slytherin pin because he is... The house of Slytherin, but he doesn't have any other stuff for him. So he has Christmas presents coming. Yay. So I got him a Slytherin pin. It's not with me. It's on my boyfriend. So got that for him. But also, too, I got me some chocolate frogs. And yes, the chocolate frogs, one, two, three, four of them. So I do apologize. These are four of the same items. But if you guys go to Wizarding World of Harry Potter, you guys are going to know that they have chocolate frogs in whatever card is in here you get stuck with. However the case may be at Universal Studios because I go in Hufflepuff attire and I mean corseted everything. If you haven't seen my Hufflepuff Pride House cosplay, go click on my other video. It's going to be in the section. So I might put that into the playlist, which is cosplay adventures. And also too, this is going to go into the halls or halls library. So check out my halls playlist. So yes, we got chocolate frogs. And guys, when I say four, I mean one, two, three, four. We traveled two days, one on Wednesday, one on Saturday, which is my boyfriend and us, for pictures and everything. So on the first day, I cannot remember which one I got. Let me quickly go through. Aha. Uh -huh. So first day, I got my chocolate frog. Now, I was four cards away from completing the whole entire set. So the card that I got that I did not want to take back is Dumbledore, yes. And if you guys do not know or haven't seen my bedroom, I put these, the boxes, like tacked to the wall, and so I can just pull down and you can see the card. So this is how I decorate them. So of course, I got me Dumbledore. As you can see, bad place. And the back, I'm gonna let you guys take a pause so you can read that in its entirety or I can read it to you but we're gonna be here an awful long time so that is Dumbledore and the cards I uh, guys I love these holographic cards love them now recently they just got another one in that is for 2017 I was unaware of that but for the 2017 card it is 
God, oh, not the wrong one. Oh, I'm getting all my chocolate frogs confused. Nope. Oh, that was just the one I pulled out. Where are you? Okay, hi, girlfriend, how you doing? Where are you? Not you. Where are you? There we go, okay. So the new card, guys, was Hengis. I always mess up his name, so sorry about the name. And this is of Woodcroft. So this was the new card that they had on at Universal Studios Wizarding World of Harry Potter. This is the new card for 2017. Got this one right off the back. And if you guys want to know, they're going to have a 2017 sticker. So you will definitely see. So here's his stuff and everything. I think the only card I am missing from this set is the Golden Dumbledore and or another card. I cannot remember what quite. So our two cards for the first day we went was Dumbledore and of course this other one here, the new card for 2017. So these were on the first day. And then of course my boyfriend actually got me my next item, which I love. Now, if you guys see my pictures on Instagram, you guys are going to see him. It is my little spider here, my little friend here of which I decorated and I also like to put him on my shoulder. Agnog, the plushie, as you can see. So this is the giant spider plushie that they have over at Universal Studios, Wizarding in the World of Harry Potter. Not a lot of people get him. I think he was the cutest thing ever when I saw him because I do Renaissance fairs and everything. I could deck him out, and of course, I did. I made him a little tiny diaper with pins and everything. And if you guys are wondering, his little butt, and there is the actual tush tag signifying whoop signifying signifying not in front of this light up oh, wait there we go kind of kind of there we go so harry potter so i made him a little tiny diaper and a little tiny like shawl slash backpack so his food and stuff like that is in there for my boyfriend a crusty crab flag burger that we got the first time we went with um Ignigma's little one then i made him a little tiny snowflake so that was, this is my favorite plushie. So on the day that we went on the second time on Saturday with friends for a photo shoot, I took him. So this plushie, if you guys are wondering, the price of the plushies was $21.99, I believe. So he is so cute. And another one of the girls had him sitting like that on her shoulder who actually worked there. And so I'm going to pin him up and he's going to be coming with me for Universal Studios. So as you can see... It looks pretty awesome just with him sitting, just like that. So this is one of my cherished items. I love it. Mwah, thank you, Enigma's little one, for getting it for me. And his little tiny food that I have in his backpack can actually fit in his little mouth pincers. So that's a good one. Um, no wands for this time around because those wands are mutually expensive. And as I come to the last of my haul, there we are. Um, then we get to Saturday. So Saturday, guys, after the spider and the first two cards, I went back because I really want to complete my collection of Harry Potter cards. And so the first one I got was, of course, Gryffindor. Now, a quick side note to these cards. If you buy a chocolate frog and cross your fingers, maybe the wizards across the counter can use their magic and they might supplement you another card if you got the same one. Because on this box, I got... Hufflepuff and Dumbledore. So this card wasn't originally mine, and same with the other one I'm going to show you. But if you request to them, hey, I have this card, I'm trying to collect, help, they're more than less going to kick you back another card or so for tradies. So, of course, I got Gryffindor. Very, very cool Gryffindor after we traded. Here is Godfrey Gryffindor. If you guys want to give it a pause and take a read. There you go. His card is very cool. And as I stated, these are going to be mounted up like this on my wall, and I could just pull it down, and you can see the card. That's how I decorate my Harry Potter shrine. And the last card that I'm going to be showing you guys is none other. The last one was Ravenclaw, and I was going for her originally, so the Ravenclaw one was Dumbledore, and the Godfrey one, or the Gryffindor, was Hufflepuff, which I got like seven of her, because of course, house colors. So we have Ravenclaw, Rowena, Rowena, yep, Ravenclaw, I don't know how to say her first name. I'm very terrible with names, guys, I apologize, and these are holographic, very nice, very, dur or was it durable, and that's the Ravenclaw. 
Okay, guys, sorry if this took a long time. You guys know me. I like to ram or like to talk, like to yik yak with you guys because I have the gift of gab. Um, if you guys did like, please don't forget to thumb up this video. Helps me a lot to know what you guys like to see on my channel, from Harry Potter hauls to 99 cent store to costumes, you name it, I like to do it. And I take a sippy sippy. Ah, from the collectible tumbler tups here. And yeah. Okay, guys, I love you so, so much. Don't forget to come rate, subscribe. Let's see if we can get this video up to two likes. Not asking for much. If you are so inclined, share it up, hook it up, because the monitoring system now, I do have money saved from YouTube, but it's not a lot, unfortunately, for me to live on. It's just 100-something. So, yeah, share it up. Try to get it past 1,000. I ain't asking for much here. If you guys, thumb up for Gryffindor, thumb up for Ravenclaw, thumb up for all the houses. I love the houses. I want to do Ravenclaw or um, Slytherin next, but I am a Hufflepuff through and through. A lot of people know me as Hufflepuff over at Universal. So yeah, guys, comment, share it up, like it up for my little spider. Oh yeah, I didn't know if you guys saw my spider. I put little Harry Potter pins that my friend Canifery gave me. So okay, guys, I love you so, so much. Thank you so much for watching. Until next time, mwah, kisses for my little spiders. For stuff like that in general. Ain't he so cute? Oh my gosh. I love you guys so, so much. Thank you so much for watching, subscribing. Follow me on all my social media sites. I love you. Mwah. Sorry for the rambling. Sorry for the talkities. But I haven't been on here in a hot ticket minute. So I really want to kind of go in depth and kind of say hi to you guys. Okay. Love you so, so much. Stay tuned for a 99 cent store haul. My boyfriend got me some stuff from, from early Christmas presents from the 99 cent store. I'm going to show you guys. Okay. Love you so, so much. Thank you so much for watching. Bye, bye. Boy, boy, he is so cute. Look at how cute he is. Take a picture. Mm, cheese. Tomorrow, one more. Okay. Bye, guys.